Socials.com Digital Marketing Strategy for the 2022 Holidays It's never too early to start thinking about your digital marketing strategy for the upcoming holiday season. To ensure that your business is prepared for the 2022 holiday season, consider implementing the following tips, start planning early. The earlier you start planning your digital marketing strategy, the better. However, if you're like most small business owners, you may dread this time of year because you know that it also brings in many customers who want to buy gifts for family members or friends. Why advance planning matters for social media marketing campaigns? Social media marketing campaigns are often planned months ahead of execution. However, it's important to make sure that every aspect of your strategy is aligned with your overall business objectives. Here are some key components of a well-planned social media strategy. Goals Audience research Content creation and distribution Add these seven things to your holiday campaign. The holidays are just around the corner. This season is filled with opportunities to make sales, increase brand awareness, and build relationships. Planning Planning is key to having successful holiday campaigns. Budgeting Don't spend too much money. Keep your budget realistic and stick to it. Content Content creation is another crucial element to have in place for seasonal campaigns. Create various content types, such as infographics, videos, social media posts, blog articles, and email newsletters. Marketing automation. Automate your marketing processes by using marketing automation software. Social media. Use social media channels to connect with customers. Customer service. You may not think of customer service as an integral part of social media marketing, but by responding to reviews and complaints online, you give your brand a human face. Email marketing. If you haven't already done so, now is the time to start building your list of subscribers. Email marketing is still one of the most effective ways to reach new customers, especially during the holidays. What are the best holiday marketing strategies? The holidays are coming fast, and it's time to start planning how you're going to market your products and services. Let's look at some of the most effective ways to market during the holiday season. Promote your new products early. If you haven't already done so, now is the perfect time to promote your new products. Use social media to get more traffic. Social media is one of the best tools to increase your site's traffic. Make sure your website is ready for Christmas. Make sure your website is ready for the holiday season by adding positive images, colors, and distinctive features. Create a special page for the holidays. You should create a unique page on your website dedicated to the holidays. Offer free shipping. Free shipping is an excellent way to attract more customers. Create a unique gift guide. A gift guide is a fantastic way to help customers find gifts for their loved ones. Give away free stuff. Give away free stuff to get visitors to your site. It doesn't matter if it's a free ebook, a free t-shirt, or a free mug, just try to get people excited with something free. Build loyalty programs. Loyalty programs are a fantastic way to build customer loyalty. Getting reviews and testimonials is effortless to show customers how much they mean to you. Integrate live chat. The holidays are upon us and businesses everywhere are gearing up to attract customers online. If you haven't already integrated live chat into your site, now might be the perfect time to do it. Live chat allows visitors to contact you directly without having to navigate away from your site. Live chat software features. Integration platform, what is the best way to integrate your live chat software into your website? Is it via a plugin, embedded code, or something else? User interface, what does the interface look like? Does it feel intuitive to use? Do you see everything you need to know about your chat window? Support, can you reach someone immediately when you encounter issues? Pricing, how much does it cost per month? Make sure your return policy is clearly stated and easy to understand. If you sell products online, it's essential to make sure your return policy is communicated. If your customers complain after purchasing an item, you don't want them to think you won't take care of them. So, what does a good return policy look like? Here are some tips to keep in mind. 
be specific about the conditions under which returns are accepted. Include examples of how to package items for returns properly. Provide a link where customers can find instructions on returning items. Offer a way for customers to contact customer support if they have questions regarding returns. Always provide proof of postage. Keep your shipping costs low. Shipping costs can add up quickly if you aren't careful. Be mindful of where you place your order, so you're not paying unnecessary fees for shipping. Give your website a festive feel by adding some Christmas decorations. The holiday season is upon us, and it's the perfect time to give your e-commerce site a festive makeover. Festive holiday decorations, this app allows you to change your product photos colors, fonts, and backgrounds to match the season. White Christmas app, this app uses AI technology to generate snowflakes and icicles that fall onto your products automatically. Holiday Shopify theme, if you don't want to create your unique theme, this one is ready. Christmas storefront templates, need something quick and easy? Try out one of these templates, which has everything you need to start selling now. If you haven't already done it, now is the perfect time to start planning your holiday marketing strategy. Here are four tips to keep in mind. Start early. Planning helps ensure you don't miss seasonal promotions. Create a plan. Decide what type of promotion you'd like to run and how much money you're willing to spend. Bundle. Consider bundling items together to make them look like presents. For example, include digital gift cards in the package along with physical goods. Offer gift wrapping services and gift cards. Use a loyalty card like Risings to increase sales by offering gifts for purchases. The good news is that people are increasingly comfortable shopping online. Here are four ways to ensure that your gift wrapping experience doesn't hurt your bottom line. Offer gift wrapping. If you want to attract more shoppers, offering gift wrapping services could be just what the doctor ordered. According to a survey conducted by Gartner, nearly 90% of respondents say they would be more likely to purchase items online if they had the option to select gift wrapping. Use loyalty programs. Loyalty programs can also help you boost your sales. When used correctly, these tools can provide additional rewards to loyal customers, such as exclusive discounts, coupons, and other incentives. Of course, not all loyalty programs are created equally, some may require more work than others. So, before you jump right in, take a moment to figure out which one will work best for your business. Personalize your emails. One way to increase conversions is to personalize your email marketing messages. The problem is that most companies send generic emails that are hard to read and uninteresting to customers. Here are three tips that can help you achieve this goal. Include links to relevant pages so that subscribers always find something useful. Send emails when your readers are most active, like during lunchtime or after work hours. Add special features. While it may seem obvious, it pays to include specific features in your website design. Leveraging historical data. Reviewing your historical data will give insight into what worked well during the last year's holidays. You can use this information to plan future holiday promotions. Don't rely solely on last year's sales figures. Last year's numbers are just one piece of the puzzle and don't tell the whole story. Your customers may have purchased items online over the months leading up to the holiday season. By analyzing your customer data, you can learn more about how they interacted with your brand throughout the year, including buying patterns, shopping trends, and product preferences. Analyzing your holiday data will also provide insights into how your customers interact and respond to your brand. Enhance customer experience. The customer experience is how customers interact with you, your brand, and your product slash service. In today's digital world, delivering an excellent adventure across every touchpoint is critical. Here are three ways to enhance the customer experience in your e-commerce store. Mobile shopping. Mobile shoppers now account for over 50% of online purchases. Personalization. Customers today demand personalized experiences, and they want to know they are being treated like individuals. Customer service. Today's consumers have grand expectations when buying products online. They want to be assured that the items they purchase will arrive in pristine condition. Tap into nostalgia. 
Nostalgia is one of the most powerful emotions we feel. When you think about it, very few things make us happier than reminiscing over our childhood memories. In today's digital world, consumers want to interact with brands on social media platforms like Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Pinterest. These sites allow businesses to reach out to their target audience fun and engagingly. Build a strong foundation. Before jumping into nostalgia marketing, it's important to lay some solid groundwork. Start by understanding why your brand exists in the first place. If you don't know where you came from, how do you know where you're headed? Once you understand your purpose, you can begin building a strategy that aligns with your goals. Use mobile devices to their fullest potential. In fact, according to a recent survey conducted by Bankrate, more than half of consumers say that text messaging helps them make decisions about purchasing products and services. Use short messages. Text messages don't always require long paragraphs, short notice can convey just as much information as a longer one. Keep it simple. If you're trying to explain something complicated, consider breaking it down into smaller pieces. You might start by defining a general concept, like the best way to clean your car, and follow up with specific instructions, such as use soap, rinse thoroughly, dry completely. Tap into niche social media channels. Social media isn't just about posting pictures of yourself and your friends. Many types of social networks are out there, each catering to a particular audience. Reddit Reddit is one of the most popular social networking sites out there. With over 300 million monthly active users, it's a great place to find information and connect with like-minded individuals. Pinterest Pinterest is another big name in the world of social media. It's an optical network where users pin images from around the web onto boards. You can use Pinterest to showcase your best work or simply show off your favorite things. Instagram Facebook owns Instagram, so it makes sense that it's part of our list. But Instagram is much smaller than Facebook, with over 500 million monthly active users compared to Facebook's 2 billion. Twitter if you've ever watched TV shows or movies, you've seen someone tweet something like Artie at. Twitter is about sharing messages and ideas and is an excellent platform for promoting your business. LinkedIn LinkedIn is more of a professional network than a social media site. However, it does have some features that make it ideal for businesses looking to build their customer base. Tumblr Tumblr is a microblogging website that's been multiplying since its launch in 2007. It's a great option if you want to reach a younger demographic. WhatsApp WhatsApp is a messaging app owned by Facebook. It's not a social networking site, but it's become increasingly popular among teens and young adults. Facebook Messenger With over 1.2 billion daily active users, Facebook Messenger is a great way to communicate with your existing customers. Snapchat Snapchat is a photo-sharing application owned by Snap Incorporated, and it was recently valued at over $20 billion. Snapchat is perfect for sending short video clips to your friends, and you can include text, stickers, filters, and emojis to spice up your snaps. Google Plus Many people think Google Plus is dead, but millions of users still actively engage on the network. There are two main reasons why G Plus isn't going anywhere anytime soon. First, it's integrated into many of Google's other properties, including Gmail, YouTube, and Blogger. Second, it's still one of the only networks where you can connect with people based on shared interests rather than just friendship. Do a multi-channel strategy. Multi-channel marketing strategies are becoming increasingly popular among marketers. These strategies allow you to reach users across different platforms, create a cohesive message across all channels, and increase your brand's exposure and engagement. Know whom you want to reach Before you even begin crafting your campaign Start by identifying your key customer segments based on demographics, behavior patterns, purchase history, and anything else you can find Find relevant data Once you know whom you want to contact, you need to figure out how to reach them This step involves finding data about your audience Conclusion As we move into the new year you must start thinking about your digital marketing strategy for the upcoming holidays. What worked in the past may not work as well in the future, so it's essential to be prepared to change your approach. 
think beyond traditional advertising channels. Social media, influencer marketing, and email marketing can be highly effective and cost-effective ways to reach your audience. Personalization is vital, consumers want relevant content from companies that understand them and what they like. It would be best if you made it easy for consumers to share your messages on social media by providing them with the right tools and resources.